we're going to walk you through your Spectora settings page in this video so you know exactly where to find all of your admin tools. From your dashboard, click the settings tab from your navigation bar. Starting from the top, you have a button for your profile. This is where you can add your company name, contact information, profile photo, and company logo. In services and fees, you will set up your primary inspection services, add-on services, and your fee structures. In availability, you will set up the available times you would like to offer your clients and agents on your online scheduler. In team, you can add other inspectors or office staff to your account and adjust each employee's permissions. In sample reports, you will find any sample reports you have made from real inspections to share with your agents or to post on your website. In discount codes, you can set up coupons that can be applied for discounts towards your primary inspection services or your add-on services. Looking at partnerships, this is an optional tool you may choose to turn on. Designed to help you maximize your earning potential, you can earn a referral commission if you choose to connect your clients to any of our highly qualified partners to help with the next steps of their home buying journey. This includes services for moving, home security, home insurance, or warranties. In recommended contractors, this allows you to strategically tag any defect comments in your report with the local contractor you trust. This includes your contractor's company name, logo, and contact information, and it's a seamless way for your clients to connect to help with repairs. Next on the list are your agreements. You can use the standard agreement available to you there or add your own. In payments, you can set up payment processing to have your clients pay for their inspection online. Your clients will sign the inspection agreement and deliver payment to you straight from their client portal. In review options, you can allow your clients to leave you a review from your client portal once the report has been published. In email settings, you can determine which email addresses will send your emails. This comes in handy if you have multiple inspectors on your account. For your text settings, you can purchase a custom texting phone number if you would like your automated text messages to come from a local area code, as well as if you need to customize your automated text messages. In quotes, you can customize the email your client will receive if you choose to send them a quote first before fully booking the inspection. Mass email, this is an add-on product. There you can set up mass emails to send to your clients and agents. Moving on to scheduling options, you can customize additional scheduling fields for your clients or agents to fill out on your online scheduler. Next is the online scheduler itself. Here you can adjust a few settings for your scheduler and you'll find your embeddable widget code to put into your website. With the online scheduler, this will only allow clients or agents to schedule your inspections for the times you have created above from your availability settings and only allow them to pick services you have created in your services and fees settings. Next, the get a quote widget is another scheduling tool to allow your clients or agents to get a quote from your website first before booking the inspection. The inspection request form is an open-ended form. If you choose to use this, your clients and agents will be able to request any date or time they would like you to perform your inspection and write in any service they would like in an open text box. Under your client portal settings, you can customize the upsell language on your client portal, as well as designate a email address for upsell requests. You will see an option in your services and fees settings above to allow upsells on any add-on services that you create. Spector Advanced, this is an additional add-on set of business tools. It's designed to help you be more efficient in the office and help grow your business. You can click the link to the right, read up on these tools a little more, and schedule a call to find out more if this is going to be a right fit for you. In Report Tools, you can change a few admin level settings, such as allowing 360 photos, enabling reinspections, or requiring a fully completed report before publishing. Recommendation Types. This allows you to customize some of your recommended contractors, as mentioned above. 
In location tags, you can customize the list of locations you use to tag comments in your report. Under company settings, you can add links to your social media pages, which will be linked on your web report. Moving down, you can also manage your subscriptions. Additionally, you can integrate other platforms under system integrations for things like repair estimates, secure 24 offers, Google Drive, QuickBooks, call centers, and more. We have a few options for importing data from various external sources. You can also find settings where you can share your agent's information on your reports. You can also find a few calendar options and localization settings here as well. Lastly, you have a few dashboard settings to adjust the look of your dashboard calendar. You can also customize the navigation bar that you see at the top of your dashboard, and you can integrate Google Calendar or any other iCal compatible calendar. You can also change your email and your password you use to log in below. We have more in-depth videos to help you set up your admin tools. Be sure to watch them and reach out to us on our chat bubble if you have any other questions.